I've got everybody, the kids and everybody, and after waiting in line for an hour to see the world premiere of this thing, I finally get up to the cashier to buy my ticket. When you know it, I didn't have my wallet with me. Talk about a letdown. Hey, wait a minute. Looks like we have a fuel imbalance. 600 pounds less on the left side at the moment, which is weird since the fuel flows have been equal since takeoff. World Travel 1392, contact Male Center now on 119.7. World Travel 1392, switching, thanks. Malay Center, World Travel 1392 with you level at 350. World Travel 1392, roger. It's possible that it's a fuel quantity gauge malfunction and not a real imbalance, but given the rate at which... Engine surge number one. That's the low fuel side. Disengage the auto throttle and bring the thrust lever back to idle. Engine failure number one. I'll call ATC. You squawk 7700, then we'll run through the checklist. Just keep flying. Molly Center, World Travel 1392 declaring an emergency. World Travel 1392, go ahead. Molly Center, World Travel 1392. We have an engine failure and a suspected fuel leak. We'll be unable to maintain flight level 350. Request an immediate descent. World Travel 1392, roger. Descend at your discretion to 10,000. Down to 10,000, World Travel 1392. All right, we've got an engine failure on the left-hand side. Make a normal descent to 10,000. With a possible fuel leak, restarting the engine could be a fire risk, so let's secure it. Ready for the checklist? Here we go. Engine failure shutdown checklist. Auto throttle, disengaged. Thrust lever, idle. Engine start lever, cut off. APU, start. APU generator, on. Engine failure shutdown checklist complete. Surge. Number two, engine failure. Okay, now we have a problem. Turn on the fastened seatbelt sign. I'll call ATC. Molly Center, World Travel 1392. World Travel 1392, go ahead. Center, World Travel 1392. We now have two engine failures and a suspected fuel leak, so we'd rather not risk restarts. Looks like we're a glider from here on down. World Travel 1392, roger. Proceed at your discretion. State number of souls on board. 155 souls, World Travel 1392. All right, Captain, maintain one nine or zero knots in the descent for best glide and let's secure this one. Engine failure shutdown checklist, auto throttle, disengaged. Thrust lever, idle. Engine start lever, cut off. APU, start. APU generator, on. Engine failure shutdown checklist complete. I'll call the cabin. Yeah, hi. Uh, we're having a little trouble up here. <laughs> we have a fuel leak which has led to dual engine failures. We're well within gliding distance of Male, so no need to panic. Yeah, I'll alert the passengers. Thanks. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, this is your uh, first officer speaking. We've experienced some engine problems related to the fuel system, and as a result, both engines have shut down. Now, due to the leak, we don't want to risk an in-flight start, so we're making an emergency diversion to Mali International Airport. A dual engine failure is a very unusual and highly unlikely occurrence, but we're currently well within gliding distance of Mali. Uh, it's a beautiful day, and air traffic control is giving us priority handling, so we should be on the ground shortly without any problems. We thank you for your cooperation in remaining calm, and ask you to please follow any instructions given to you by the flight attendants. We'll update you as we get closer to the airport. out gliding towards Malay. World Travel 1392, you're cleared for the visual approach to runway 18. Ground equipment is standing by. World Travel 1392, roger.
four miles from the runway now. Lower the landing gear, slowly add full flaps, and reduce speed to 140 knots for the approach. Almost there. Landing checklist. Landing gear, down. Flaps Sink rate. set for landing. Sink rate. Lower the flaps. Landing checklist complete. Travel 1392, welcome to Mali. Emergency equipment is rolling. Nice job.